Jackie was the most famous person in the world, and she was aware of that iconography. This wasn't just fame, this was history. We're at the height of the Cold War. There's tremendous turmoil. Jack and Jackie were the new generation, the hot generation. And Jack was constantly alluding to the fact that it was going to be a brave new world and he was going to lead us into it. We created the Kennedys as well. She kind of became the queen. She really was literally made into a movie star. People would write Jackie letters like fan mail. They'd want to know what she'd do with her hair. They'd copy the way she dressed. Her great art, her great masterpiece was the light. She lived consciously. She lived conscientiously. Jack had been warned many times that his life would be in danger. It appears as though something has happened in the motorcade route. Something, I repeat, has happened in the motorcade route. People were frightened. Throughout it all, Jackie remained calm, dignified. She really, in a big way, held the country together. I don't think people should forget President Kennedy. You know, is it just going to be forgotten or ended? Or is some way going to be found to make it keep going? You know, maybe you'll plant a seed somewhere, then someone else like President Kennedy will come along. And those are the kind of men who are going to save the world. Her vision was not only for her husband's presidency, but for the country. She left her fingerprints on history. She wanted to have the kind of definition of a real life, not a postcard or an icon. She wanted to have those kind of real relationships that make life matter. There was never anyone like her before, and I don't think there will be anyone.